Hello everybody, I, my name is Chikili. Today I would like to share about my study on uh, Yemen, K, uh, this country. And the topic is about the uh, role of tribalism in understanding the uh, is this integration of Yemen, which is to uh, look into the Ali Abdullah Sola uh, families and the, uh, his uh, co correlation to the uh, facts of uh, Yemen. Uh, it aims to analyze the role of tribalism in creating the Saleh uh, dynasty and correlation with the, uh, this integration of Yemen. It will use case studies analysis and textual analysis to find out the uh, document, find out the uh, source of uh, understanding the family of uh, Ali Adul Saleh. And it is essentially an endographic research because uh, in Arab society, uh, triple, uh, triples, uh, or trips is very important to them. Uh, in their entire life, they uh, spend all of their life on the triples affair, and they usually communicate with their trips treatment or trips woman. Sana is the capital of Yemen. Uh, their current president is Abdurrahman Mansur Hadi. Over 80 percent uh, people are Arabs, and there are some uh, other races such as Somali, African Arab, or uh, Africa. Uh, the famous kingdom uh, uh, in Yemen uh, for Himya Saba, uh, which has been uh, have been recorded uh, in Bible and Quran, and then uh, in southern uh, Yemen uh, it could be regarded as the oldest. Arab civilization uh, sons since the emergence of people. They uh, settled down here and created the civilizations. Thus, Yemen became one of the oldest uh, civilizations uh, in the uh, past. South Yemen uh, became British protectorate uh, in modern history, while um, Ottoman Empire uh, declined and then they, they faced with a uh, foreign trade at the time. Uh, the picture uh, is uh, is about the map at the, uh, of Yemen at the time. Uh, in North uh, Yemen, uh, it was ruled by uh, Shia dynasty, and in South Yemen, most of them were the uh, Sunni dynasty, and then they are st uh, just uh, they are just a small state, which uh, could not able to conference against the uh, the North uh, Shia dynasty and also the uh, Ottoman Empire. So uh, regarding to the definitions of trade, tribalism refers to customs and beliefs uh, transmit and then act in groups uh, troops sharing a common identity and which centralized uh, political organizations and authority are uh, absent. So uh, in this case, uh, tribalism in Yemen means that uh, according to the history of Yemen, uh, they had not experienced the centralized government for a long time before the arrival of Islam. After the arrival of Islam, uh, even they had initiated with the uh, Arab Empire, they had not experienced the centralized government. They just only initiated with the uh, central gov uh, government in kind of religious exchange or the business content. However, uh, to them the centralized political government uh, was a very uh, unimaginable uh, thing. They prefer the triple management rather than the centralized government. So uh, the common dialect, common territory, and a certain homogeneity in their cu uh, culture will be very important in uh, in their cu uh, culture. And according to Dr. Jawa Ali in his book, Sajana uh, Arab Sabalam Islam or uh, History of Arab Before Islam, she defined that uh, Gabila, uh, which is uh, standing for trips, could be uh, to get uh, get the same meaning with sharp 
in my uh, fast, uh, fast la. This kind of word could be uh, stand for uh, the same meaning of uh, trips or a uh, trip man, trip woman, or and uh, even the similar thing uh, in Arab verb. Uh, then it also correlated with the f uh, family structure in every society. How to understand the triple society in Yemen? Indeed, in this uh, concept, the formation of triple society in Yemen could be uh, formed by four important elements. They are the religious school, Yemenese historical development, triple area, and be triple belongingness. Regarding to the triple belongingness, they uh, usually spend their whole life uh, in initially with their triple men and triple uh, women. They speak in the same language, they practice the same culture, they believe the same religion, and even share the same uh, value with uh, other uh, people. So, uh, in, uh, regarding to the uh, ide uh, personal identity, they usually uh, th they say that themselves as the uh, belong to which kind of troops, rather than they will say that, that uh, they are Yemeni. This was uh, so this kind of culture uh, is different from other pe uh, people or foreign country, and then we, uh, because they have their own uh, living area. They have their own live and uh, different territory, so uh, each uh, or every trip will hold a different uh, place, different city, or even uh, even different village. Then this subject to the uh, stretch of the country to them, the trips could be uh, interchangeable with the kind of country. Even Dr. Jawa Ali also say that. They do, uh, do not have the concept of government, but they only have the concept of chippo area. So uh, then uh, th they have a very uh, important uh, family structure. The, the Java Alice uh, stand for the different kind of uh, name about the trip uh, chippo structure. And actually, uh, it could be uh, referred to the family structure of uh, in Yemen, and then a uh, historical uh, development also subjected to the uh, Yemen uh, development. And the north uh, Yemen usually be a uh, practice uh, Ismail and Saudi uh, Shia uh, Islam, and then a uh, southern Yemen usually practice Sunni Islam, and then uh, in different place uh, consists of uh, di uh, different uh, kind of troops and. Uh, in Yemen, and they uh, set up uh, uh, around uh, Yemen at uh, different uh, time and different place. Uh, every trip has uh, has their own story, has their own history, and then the, the, their own government. Then the, after the uh, collapse of Yemen, uh, uh, especially uh, uh, the fall of Ali Abdul uh, uh they faced with their different kind of uh, national crisis, and uh, until now they ha had not stopped it. Ali Abdul Salat uh, came from Bandar Sahan in an Amman uh, village. He used to be a soldier uh, in Mutawakili dynasty, and that he got access in politics uh, in 1974 after the group detached against the former president, and he became a uh, president until the rise of Arab Spring, and that uh, uh, he started to monopolize the power, which the uh, power to stop Yemen after unification Yemen. And then uh, this chart also uh, talk about how uh, Ali Abdullah monopolized uh, the power, national power, even the diplomatic power, uh, to his family. He, his son, his son-in-law, hold uh, uh, important uh, positions such as the military position and the sp uh, security force. He threw that uh, 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 this position uh, were very important to him because he wants to guarantee the, the holding of power, especially pres presidency power. And therefore, the political power and economy uh, uh, activities, uh, he distributed uh, this power to his siblings uh, or even uh, his uh, wife families. Uh, he uh, he he got four wives, and then uh, the uh, important wives are the second, 
third and fourth. They also uh, uh, held uh, some important position in political economy department take, and then uh, uh, triple affair uh, respectively. Uh, so uh, he had uh, he, his own uh, concept of the kingdom or even the federalism. He, he held the position of president. Platinum and Metino family, family held a uh, uh, position of median tree, uh, which uh, could be regarded as a princess or prince. And siblings, son and son-in-law uh, held a commandant and uh, and then in the five generations, uh, cousins or relatives held the important position in economy affair or triple affair, uh, which could be regarded as nobles uh, in, in Yemen. And then uh, his constant uh, kinship and the constant in laws uh, held the governor, minister, ambassador, or uh, businessman, or even landlords. Uh, so the normal Yemen only uh, s uh, show their loyalty to Shara. So th 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 this is his concept of the uh, Shara dynasty, and he helped the people to follow the, uh, his concept. So uh, in conclusion, uh, his uh, major concept was uh, Saidi Sahan Shara because uh, he was a uh, Shia Muslim, and he hoped the Shia most, uh, Muslim uh, pow uh, power could be uh, prolonged as long as he, he, he could do. And the uh, appointment also uh, reflects uh, his uh, grandparents' uh, information because an past uh, scholar uh, could not able to get access on the information of his grandparents. And then the position uh, of uh, important uh, government position uh, could be uh, see that this uh, kind of proof. And the liberate marriage among the children uh, which could be regarded as the legacy of triple culture in Arab still uh, 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 still appear in his uh, employment. All of the crises should be solved before he it could treat to his power and personal safety. Family ruling in Yemen and overseas could guarantee his power to be held by him uh, safely. And that because of his uh, family's uh, kingdom, and uh, rule uh, Yaman for a long time. So uh, uh, the triple confrontation and north-south confrontation are still not uh, solved until now. Uh, and it uh, brought out uh, the uh, tragedy uh, to his people and people uh, uh, are still uh, facing with the uh, national disintegration and uh, the terrorism and even the war payment and also uh, the spreading of COVID-19 until now. And that's why uh, the leaders should not put monopolize the power into his family, but rather uh, they are better to share the power with their, uh, with their people. That's my presentation.